Oh, beautiful. What's going on, everybody? Good morning, good morning. It's Monday of the week. I'm still off today and tomorrow, so I'm getting a lot of other stuff done. But I did pick up the Modern Order, which I had six cards in. Went 50% of my six cards for uh, PSA 10s, which was really good. Um, not bad overall. This was researched and I did March, middle of March of last year. So just under a year till it came back. I mean, well, from the time it was researched and ID or logged in, however you want to say it. But overall, pretty happy with it. Uh, some of the stuff a little bit decreased. Some of it went up. You know how it goes. So let's hit the nines first here. 1993 Upper Deck, Jordan. This is card 438. Yes, the X split's still right there. I got to get with them. Hopefully, we should have this eliminated here and, uh, tomorrow. I'm going to spend with them trying to figure out my, why my account's all messed up. But anyhow, there you go, nine. And this is all stuff. This is no joke. I picked all these up in a huge deal, all these Jordans, at one time from a guy came by my table. And I, you know, went through, picked the good ones up, put the other ones back in a dollar box type deal, but did pretty well. Sky Lights, Jordan, PSA 9, same year, 93 upper deck, card 466. I was really hoping this would attend. Um, but yeah, just something on to it. I can't remember what I saw. I think it might have been just this little bit down here. The corner kind of like kicks out just a little bit. And I don't want to mess with stuff like that. But I'll take it as a nine. I think this is like a fifty or sixty dollar car as a nine. The other one's like twenty five thirty. Pulled this when I was doing back my Thursday throwbacks before prices went stupid. Bo Jackson Provisions. I love these from back in the day. PSA nine. This is around sixty dollar card too. Um, real hard because of the uh, black borders. There's a little bit of white just up here in the corner. I figured. Why not get this graded back then? Um, for I think we paid twelve dollars a card, and I know tens were like close to one hundred and fifty. Nines were doing like fifty, sixty, seventy dollars. Then they pushed up. Then they went back down to where they were. So which is good, a really nice card. This is like to me the original, like what um, Panini was doing with Kabooms and Downtowns and all that. Provisions. Not how many people remember these from back in the day? But they were really cool. I still have a green one on Clemens out in another order. So maybe we'll get one ten. All right, now the tens. Another one from a box I opened up from Throwback Thursdays from back in the day. 92 Ultra All-Stars Griffey. PSA 10. I was really wondering on the center left and right onto this. And then, because I didn't realize you had to go from this logo of the ball over until somebody squared me away with that. But it did 10. Last I saw, I thought these were doing somewhere between the neighborhood of 120 to 160. I could be off. Not sure, but again, did really well on this. <clears throat> Had one more of these Jordans, the 438 from the 93 Upper Deck, PSA 10. I want to say it's around 150 for the card, so pretty good, pretty good. Especially when you just... Somebody comes by your table with a stack of Jordans and old, like, top loaders. <laughs> and they're like, uh, give them to you for 20 bucks. I'm like, all right, done. This I pulled a while ago when I uh, won a box of 12, 30. Actually, I won two boxes of this SP Authentic from this year. We were chasing Jordan autos. We didn't pull anything good. But the Jordan, this was the one Jordan base I kept, and it tend. Of course, you know, it's in Tar Heels uniform. Last sold $75, so... To me, big win on this order for being modern. Um, this was all done with this. I know people always ask me. None of this stuff was done with Dream Crusher. It was done with this. Big old my thing. It has a light on it and stuff. And that's what I was using for the longest time. The jeweler loops just were too small for me and stuff. I, my eyes were going buggy. I think I already showed the Camavinga, or the Camavinga. Wow. Woo. Not Camavinga, that uh, thing from GV. But yeah, everybody else's cards are laying over on the side here. I get those shipped, but I wanted to share this real quick with everybody today. Really good on the modern. Um, 
you just got to pick through stuff or hopefully you open it up and it's, you know, in good shape type deal. But other than that, guys, have a good week. I'll have the uh, the 10,000 Club member or PSAL exclusive member uh, video out tomorrow. I still got to work the numbers on it. Um, I wanted to do it last night, but PSA wrapped me up pretty long getting this uh, order out. So be on the lookout for that video tomorrow, overtime on Friday. As of now, I will not be going to the Frankfurt show on Saturday. <clears throat> I'm just, I think I'm going to take that weekend just to clear my head a little bit out. And the following weekend, I'll be set up in Louisville anyhow. So if you guys are in the Louisville area, stop by, say hello on the 19th. Other than that, take care, guys. Have a good one. And I'll see you guys next video.